So I often wonder if I was on a desert island or if I had to choose one makeup, what would it be? And um, probably for many years, I would have said concealer because I've always had um, little rings under my eyes and I felt quite self-conscious about them. So concealer was my, my main thing. But I think I would now change that for a lip pencil and it, and it would have to be this lip pencil, which is the one by Studio 10 that I, that I want to show to you. Um, it, it mimics the rosy colour of lips. It's not meant to go with a lipstick or anything. It's meant to just enhance your own lips. And the reason I would choose this is one of the many, many, many fun things that happens as you get older is your lips start to disappear and get thinner. And when you never had very big lips to begin with, um, you know, that can be a bit of a problem. So I... I don't feel dressed until I have some of these on, some of this on my lips. It's the colour of rosy lips. So in my, in my case, that's slightly darker than my own lips. And I use it in, in a couple of different ways. So I'll use it to just outline uh, my lips on the outer rim of my, of my lips. And then I'll slightly blend it. And then I'll usually wear it with this balm. I mean, this is what I sort of wear every day. It's the Studio 10 Lip Balm, which is a balm. So it moisturizes your lips and it's a lovely peachy color and I, and I just love it. And, um, or I'm, I might just put this pencil all over my lips and, and maybe then put the balm on or not. Or I'll, I'll use it and then apply my lipstick because it, it sort of goes with everything because it's the color of your lips. So what I do is I put it on the outside of my lips. I'm, I'm concentrating here because as ever, there's no mirror here. No, I have no mirror. I'm literally doing this in the camera. I like to think I'm so good at this though, that I don't need a mirror because this is something I do quite a lot. I'm going to overdo it. So if it's a little darker than my lips, I'll, I'll go like that. Um, now I've got nothing on my lips and I've just put a little bit on the outside of my lips, but I think already my mouth looks more defined. And what you use this little thing for, the highlighter, is really clever. So you do it above the, the cupid's bow. And it just mimics a little pout. It just makes your lips look slightly poutier. Um, and then I put on uh, the lip balm. I don't put a lot on, it's, it's, it's quite glossy. So if I want a full gloss, I'll put on loads. If I just want a, a little, I just put on a little, it just moistens your lips. It's a, a lovely, colour, it's an everyday colour, it's light, would be great for the beach or whatever. So um, yeah, the, these are my two go-tos and I would say right now, Desert Island, well I take SPF obviously, um, SPF and number two, my lip liner, Number three, this, although I think these should be allowed together, don't you? Because they do go together. So I'm going to count that as one item.